and then he hops on the horse and off he goes it's exciting to see Indiana Jones toys at retail again. This is the new Worlds of Adventure series, and it's a 2.6 inch tall action figure with accessories and little play sets. This is Indiana Jones with a horse. So this is what we see on the front, and I gotta say, I love this art. You're gonna hear me say that in every video. I love this art. If they change up to something that's kind of sucky, then I probably won't, but I love the art. Over here on this side of the package, you see a couple little scenes. These represent the different, the several different sets. There are three sets in total. And so that's kind of like their cross sale right there. Flip it around here to the back and you see everything that's included in the box. The size of the figure and all these accessories, we'll get into that. And on this side of the box you show, they show you kind of how things hook together, what fits where, and we'll get to that in just a moment. But I say let's get this box right open. And here is Indiana Jones with horse, and we're going to rip out the rest of these accessories so you can see what's in there and toss this off to the side. So what do you get in here? You get this little side pouch that will attach to the horse right up here, like so. You got to be careful. We'll talk about this horse in a minute. You get this whip in whipping action, extending. And you get the old faithful scary snake because Indiana Jones is scared to death of snakes. You get his little side pouch to hang on him and you get the Holy Grail. This is a set from the kind of represents the last crusade, the third movie. So we get Indiana Jones in his typical what you would probably imagine jacket attire and this one is different from than the one we looked at once before the previous set that i looked at the backpack one had a rotation here at the arms or the elbows of course this one has a wrist rotation that's the only difference otherwise his articulation is just the same rotation hinge at the elbows the shoulders golly and independently moving legs at the waist and a ball joint at the neck and then the wrist rotation and i think this is pretty cool the horse is actually not too bad either we're going to slide this off for a second so the horse has the head that will go back and forth just a little ways and has four four legs of course but each leg has a rotation back and forth like that so that's not too bad and that's about all you get out of this horse it does have some reins up here the tail plugs in as you can see here i don't think it's meant to rotate i wouldn't try it it might just just might break off but uh you can slide indiana jones onto the horse and get the horse into some sort of a running position but you're going to want to be careful about that balance make sure you balance that horse really well so that Indiana can stay on the horse. Even if sometimes he has trouble staying on horses. Uh, I'm not going to spend the time to hook him up, but you get the idea right there. Now, the saddlebag, let's just lay the horse over. Put the horse to sleep for now. Open up the saddlebag and you can tuck the grail inside there. Which and then hook on either side of the horse. You might want to actually just keep it on this side since this is the side that's got the one unusable unposable leg these are so fun it's just these are cool and you could slide this right on over his head actually let's uh take this back off can slide this over the arm and the head like so and he's got his side pouch there and doesn't he look so indiana like and we get no we'll keep the snake away let's give him his whipping of whips that's right i said it the whipping of whips and we'll do this because he's getting ready to swing it he's like going whip, psh. i didn't actually mean to hit the horse you know he's going for the snake not the horse though the snake over here is trying to scare the horse you and there goes the snake. <laughs> and then he hops on the horse and off he goes. And then we'll do a height comparison with the only other small action figure line that I've got, a 2.5 inch micro Fortnite series. They're not too far off. They're just a little bit off. I, you might be able to make these work together. Maybe not. If you need an Indiana Jones kind of micro figure to go in your Fortnite, because hey, 
my Indiana Jones is now that guy from Fortnite, then uh, this just might work for you. Thank you for watching. We'll see you in the next one.